In this video we're going to be discussing um, date formatting in a list control on a UX component, uh, especially in the context where the uh, list control is uh, updatable because it has an associated detail view. So the issue with uh, date formats becomes complicated because the uh, server where the application is hosted might be using one format. For example, if the server is hosted in the US it's possible that the, uh, or in fact likely that the date format on the server will be uh, month, day, year format, but if a particular uh, user of the application is located say in the UK, that user is going to want the date format uh, in his application to appear as day, month, year format. So um, right now you can see uh, in, in this case here the date formats are uh, US format, they're in month, day, year format. So if I go for example and choose today's date which is December the 16th, you can see that we have it in month, day, year format. But let's go now and change this component so that it's, so the component is using a, a day, month, year format. So I'm going to go over here to properties and scroll down to the date format and set the date format right now to be um, uh, day, month, year format. And uh, in a real application, what you would do is after the user logs in, you would look up that particular user's preference and then you would set a session variable, the client side, this um, session variable here called protected client side date format so that each user of the application would have a different date format depending on their own uh, particular preference. But in this case, we're going to hard code this UX component to use um, day, month, year format. But when we go and run the component again, we can see that the list is still displaying the data in uh, month, day, year format. So we'll go back to the list now and we'll configure the list so that the uh, display format is day, month, year. So we'll go over to fields and then we'll go to the order date field over here. But notice that we're not going to do it using the server-side display format because we don't want the we don't want to mess with the server-side display format. This particular server is running uh, on a machine where the uh, regional settings are set to month, day, year. So we want to leave the dates in that format. Otherwise, we're going to get problems when we try to uh, commit the data to the database. And we're going to focus only on the client-side display format. So I'm going to go here and I've got several options. None, which is do nothing. And then default, which means use the global setting that we set for this UX component, which we just did when we change the, the properties, uh, the, the, the global date format for this component to be day, month, year. Uh, or we can set an explicit format for this field. So I'm going to go here and say set to default and I just want the date portion um, of, the of the default date format. So now when we go ahead now and run the component, we'll see that all of the date fields now are in uh, day, month, year format the date picker is going to be c configured correctly so it opens up correctly so let's go here and set this to say today's date and then hit the save button so you can see now we've got the um, data committed to the list control and then when we go ahead and hit synchronize everything synchronizes correctly so um, the uh, ability to set the client side date format so that each user has a date format that's appropriate to whatever their personal preferences are uh, and where that date format on the client side is different than the server side date format is a powerful addition to the list control. Thanks very much for watching.